Hello and welcome to a special Thanksgiving edition of Kitchen Corrections. Um, guys, uh, it, uh you're, you're actually supposed to do is, uh, uh actually, uh, that's not how you were, uh, supposed to do it. It's a segment where I go after prominent YouTube chefs and, um, correct any little oopsies they might have made. Except this recipe comes from YouTube's hip younger brother, TikTok. And, oh my god, this has to be the worst recipe video I have ever seen. You were this close to banning it, bro, and you blew it. No wonder you lost. So why am I calling this the worst recipe video I have ever seen? I'll just let the TikTok speak for itself. Cut out squares from a store-bought pumpkin pie. Add a dollop of whipped cream right on top of each bar. Sprinkle pumpkin pie seasoning. You're about to be the hostess with the mostest. Yeah, that is literally the entire video. I know I should be ripping my hair out and cursing so loudly they'll be able to hear me in Taiwan, but honestly, I'm just so amazed at the incompetence of this video. It's so inept, it's almost avant-garde. Anyway, I don't need to dive even further. Let's make some real pumpkin pie bars from scratch. First things first, preheat the oven to 375. Has the Chinese government put an end to your democracy? The number you're looking for is... Okay, the first thing we gotta do is make a graham cracker crust. So take five ounces of graham crackers or one prepackaged package and put it in the food processor. You know, my food processor isn't the strongest, so let me help it out a bit. Process this nice and fine. Okay, once they're all nice and pulverized like this, while pulsing it, drizzle in four tablespoons of melted unsalted butter. Okay, once you do that, grab a nine by nine glass baking dish. Then using a bottom heavy glass, just tamp down on our graham cracker crumbs until you have it mostly compacted. Stick our graham cracker crust into our 375 degree oven and blind bake it for 10 minutes. Okay, while the crust cools off, let's get to work on the filling. I have in this bowl two eggs and three egg yolks. Whisk them nice and good. All right, next, add one cup of brown sugar. One pound of pureed pumpkin. Add in one and a half teaspoons of pumpkin pie spice. And a pinch of salt. And finally, one cup of heavy cream. And finally, put our custard on top of our crust. All right, take our pie and put it in our 375 degree oven. Yes, keep the temperature the same. And let it cook for 35 to 40 minutes. Okay, after 35 minutes, it should be looking like this. If it jiggles slightly, it's done. Now put it on the counter to cool and once it's cool, stick it in the fridge so it can solidify. After coagulating in the fridge, cut them up into squares and dig right in. And that's the real, actual way to make pumpkin pie bars. I swear, TikTok and its brain deadness never ceases to amaze me. I mean, who's stupid enough to start a TikTok account anyway? Is TikTok now in the hands of Oracle? Is it safe to come back now? Follow me on TikTok, by the way. This has been Chase Cutting Kitchen. I'm CRJ, making cooking fun and meaning it this time. Thanks for watching. If you liked the video, smash the like button. If you really liked the video, 
become a subscriber and hit the bell notification icon. I upload every Thursday. Don't forget to follow me on Twitter and Instagram and support me on Patreon. And yes, you can follow me on TikTok too. I'd rather hang out there than Twitter's toxic cesspool. <laughs>